previously in Cyberpunk 2077. Whoa. What was that now? So, what now? What now, she said. <laughs> the title match. You go up against Razor Hughes. <laughs> you won't get far in this sport without confidence. But you know, positive thinking's only gonna get you so far against an opponent like Razor. Listen, V, a gunfight broke out in a cafe on the waterfront. See what's going on over there. If it's a cyber psycho problem, I want the problem to stay alive. Oh. Hell hath no fury like a woman scorned. Never sign a contract without knowing what you're getting into. Kind of like when I step into this busted down degraded car, I'm not sure what I'm getting into. A reliable vehicle or a death trap waiting to happen. And now to continue. Right, enough contemplating life's great mysteries. Let's figure out what job I'm doing next. And it is absolutely not that. What do we have nearby still? I mean, there is a, another Ripper Dock I could go and visit. I've got a decent amount of money, although I do still really want a new vehicle. Hmm. Choices, choices. There is an apartment over here. 80000 though. I don't know if I want to spend that much on an apartment. Um, we've still got a couple other side jobs in this area that could be handled, but I've also got... some other things to do up in Watson. I, I've got things all over the place. I want to do them all, and I just don't know if I have the time... I'm also really, really close to this. And I'm wondering if it might be advantageous to uh, sneak my way into Dogtown. Or figure out... Maybe I'm not going into Dogtown. I, th I mean, it seems like it's the most logical explanation as to why whoever this person is that contacted me wants me to go to Dogtown is because she's got business for me in Dogtown that has something to do with my implant and, and the relic and, and everything going haywire. I don't understand what is going on here. So maybe it'd be worthwhile to go find out. But I still have so much other stuff that I have not done. That I really want to do. That I don't know. Go to Mega Building H8 in the afternoon. Why? What is that one? Uh... I genuinely have no idea what that is. None whatsoever. Yeah, I'm at a complete loss for what to do here. That's also really far away. It's like clear across town. I'm thinking maybe I should do like... Like these. Like, I could start with this side job here, and then I've got to go meet Miss Perales. Maybe I could start there. Let's get the politician out of the way, perhaps. This is the problem with having so much to do and what seems like never enough time to do any of it. I never know where to start 
like I want to do one thing in one particular spot or or do a bunch of things in one particular spot so I can start doing a bunch of things in one particular spot and then I all of a sudden get oops get uh, get a, get a job that starts in with that spot but then takes me clear across town So I get stuck in a new area with new jobs, and, and it just keeps kind of going in that fashion. Now that I think about it, the mega building thing. I didn't know what it was. Is that... Isn't the mega building where Clouds is? I, I kind of feel like that's where Clouds is. Oh, my poor car. Uh, I promise I'll, I'll drive something else very soon. Uh, um, Are you v? Yes, Please, yes, in I'm V. Step in the... Um, oh, okay. Okay. Hello, V. I'm Jefferson Perales. Oh, God, You've already you're here, too. Elizabeth, uh, my wife. Um... N n nice to meet nice you. Nice to meet you, Mr. Perales. Mrs. Perales. Hmm, right again, Liz. You see, my wife is a great judge of character. Uh huh. Said this would work. Now so I what see would work? Why. I'm I'm confused. Y you are you're the guy running for mayor, right? I'm not I'm not crazy about this. Perales, the one running for mayor of Night City. The one. So the one who was DA until recently, but just vaulted into a seat on the city council. I gather you now understand why discretion is of the utmost importance. I mean, yeah, you're a politician. Everything needs to be discreet, but that doesn't explain what I'm here for. So, what do you got for me? Carter, let's go. Elizabeth? Well, as you're probably aware, Mayor Lucius Rhine recently passed. I uh, uh, um, want to know how, my, why, my, what, whatever else is. Where's my car? I mean, it's not really a secret. He's gone. It was all over the news. Of course it was. Media feasted for weeks. Pieces like that are their lifeblood. Right. Think they missed something? What? what we what have reason to, to believe they did. Yes. What happened to my car? Uh, yeah, yeah, I'm gonna go out on a limb and say that it, it wasn't natural, we, was it? As far as I remember, someone tried to zero Ryan a few days before his death. The NCPD sees no link. They're saying it was a random cyber psycho attack. And claiming the mayor died of natural causes. Causes unrelated to the attack. It's in the official reports. Ryan died at home due to a cardio implant malfunction. Yeah, I didn't really buy it either, but at the same time, I don't follow politics. I've got my own problems I deal with. These suspicions of yours wouldn't have anything to do with the upcoming election, would they? Of course they would. If Lucius Ryan was murdered, we want to know. Need to know. Okay. And why do you suspect police were, um... You think they're lying. What makes you think the cops got him wrong? Got any evidence? Shortly before Ryan passed, he made cuts in the NCPD budget. Perhaps got on someone's bad side that way. In any case, we have the cyber psycho attack on a BD. Our chief of security Whoa. scanned it, but didn't find anything out of the ordinary, so to speak. We need a brain dance editor, a real one. It's raw footage. The brain dance. It has to be back where it belongs today. You got his last memory? If you agree to help, you can see it right now. How did you get it? Where'd you get the scroll? Ryan was making a public appearance. BD scrolling standard procedure for events like that. Following the attack, the NCPD impounded the footage as evidence. We had to pull many strings to extract it. I'm sure. Something like that probably isn't cheap. All right, I'll take a look at it. All right, see what I can do. I mean, I'm in the car. Excellent. We'd be happy with any find that would clarify things. Alleviate what? lingering doubts. 
I mean, I might as well. I'm here. No point in wasting everybody's time by simply telling you no and saying goodbye. Have a nice day. Oh, now let's hope I remember how to do this. Well, what do we got here? Johnny, Question you're not is, supposed to be what here. Are you doing here. My brain too, isn't it? Uh, technically it's neither of Don't our stop. brains. Don't go scrolling every ass you see. Eyes on the mayor. Stuff belongs to City Hall. Let's make it PG. Uh-huh. Okay. Hold up. We've got... Things to deal with already. Who's the Hulk guy? No idea. Those ass clowns are all the same. Okay. Let's switch to the sound layer. Second conference in three days. No idea what this blitz is for. That's why I'm mayor and you're not. Now's when we need the visibility. You're spreading yourself too thin. I'll rest tonight. My room at the Red Queen's race is ready. Yes, of course. Good. Now go. Out of practice. Red Queen's race. Cause any intersynapse zaps? Sure, a bunch of old Brit farts and powdered wigs shouting, Off with their heads! You know, you're allowed to say you don't have a clue. Alright. Let's rewind again. PG. Second conference in three days. No idea what this blitz is for. That's why I'm mayor and you're not. Now's when What else do we got? You're spreading yourself too thin. I'll rest tonight. My room at the Red Queen's race is ready. Yes, of course. Okay. Now go. Security doors. What do we have here? Anything of interest? Out of practice. So far, nothing out of the ordinary. Mayor's trying to prepare his speech. Our uh, cameraman is standing by. Ready to record the event. I'm not... I'm not seeing anything of any particular significance here. Chairs. They left another security door. The attack. Looks planned. Like it was done on purpose. That or the psycho saw his chance and took it. Don't get paranoid on me. I don't know. Nothing seems out of the ordinary. Just, oh. Who's that guy? Hold it. Stop right there. Uh, yeah, hold it. Who are you? He, he seems to have... Okay, apparently Slow he has security your access. We reward NCPD. Police. Let him in? Let him wait. It's important. Gotta speak to the mayor's chief of security. Prem, do it after the conference. Whoa, whoa, whoa. He... I'm just gonna waltz right in. Terminal crashed right as he went through the gate. Glitch was no accident. Nah. Seen stranger coincidences. And who's like, our new friend here? Like when you bang some chick and then her sister later, same night. And it turns out they're both sisters of God. That really happened to you? Nah, but it could have. Ha ha, Johnny. That's enough from the damn peanut gallery. Thank you. Could have chromed half the city with what he was packing. 
probably what happened. Body disappeared from the morgue, sight unseen. And then some pig got himself a new set of wheels and an ugly ass suit. Know that? Or just talking out your ass again? Once you've seen all I've seen, don't need to know things to know them. People are the same everywhere. Okay, it's coming out your ass. Oh, well, well. Okay, but it doesn't look like he actually made it to the mayor. Alright, let's go back. We've still got an audio file to search here. Let's backtrack a bit and see who's got what to say. Do it after the conference. Ah. Cop wanted to tell security something. Probably that he was standing by to lick Ryan's butthole. No, no, there's something else. Dream. Do it after the conference. He's humming something. That seems Dude, a bit unusual. Don't recognize it. Tune. What he's humming. Wouldn't call that a tune. He's really into it. And what would you call it? So the assassin failed. Didn't even get really get close to the mayor, so... I don't see any foul play here. Unless the, the cyber psycho, quote unquote, was sent by someone else. And it was here. simply a failed hit job. And then they came back later to finish the job. So, any thoughts? Did you uh, see anything suspicious? Anything at all? Or are we paranoid? Uh... No, I think you might be on to something. Pretty sure this uh, guy was a hit man, not a random the? cyber psycho. Whole thing stinks worse than Coronado Bay in July. So suspicions confirmed. Any questions at this point? Uh, yeah. Who's Holt? Who's Holt? Ryan's deputy and his bulldog, so to speak. Running in Ryan's place now. Right, right. He's the one who's taking over. What exactly was the conference about? The conference? Why was it held? For no particular reason. Ryan liked the sound of his voice and seeing himself on TV. <laughs> yeah, that sort of thing. As far as I recall, the drop in Night City's violent crime rate was the excuse for this one. Ryan came out to tout it. Sorry, drop? Ryan reclassified Pacifica an independent district. Stats for that part of town stopped counting. Ha, huh, clever. Skeevy politicians will be skeevy. What's the best way to improve your numbers? Pretend they don't exist. Is everything all right? What is the Red Queen's race? Red Queen's race. What is it? Got me. Never heard of it. Sorry. They were talking about it. So who is the cop? The cop who saved Ryan. Know anything about him? Detective River Ward. Good guy. We worked a few cases together. You want to talk to him? I'll put you in touch. Yeah, might be good. Who else has access to that security terminal? Anyone else besides Ryan's detail have access to the terminal? Hmm. NCPD. That's it. So whoever let the cyber psycho in was affiliated. Mayor's hustle. They NCPD? No. All handpicked by Holt. And on a corpse payroll, but you don't there are say. Cops among them. Yeah, I'll call Rivers. Ward had great timing. 
either has crazy good luck or had a source. Got good info. I'm gonna need some of each. Well said. I'm sending you his deeds. If you need anything else, let us know. We'll help. Much appreciated. The guy who broke into the security terminal didn't trigger the alarm. And the alarm was active because it went off when, when River went through it. The uh, Detective Ward. So, the Cyber Psycho had security clearance. All of the mayor's bodyguards were, were put on their detail by his second-in-command, Holt. Most of them have past NCPD experience, meaning they all have security clearance, too. I may be jumping to conclusions, but I think Holt put out a... Holt staged the whole damn thing. Let's see what River has to say about it. This is Ward. Who am I talking to? Name's V. Looking into the death of one Lucius Rhine. Wonder why? You're not a cop. Where there's... Uh, I was hired. Jefferson and Elizabeth Perales hired me to do it. Presumptive mayor sniffing around his predecessor's untimely death. Interesting. Done some digging. Got more intel. Also interesting. All right. I'm headed to Chubby Buffaloes. Be there, stat. You're headed where? Chubby what? Okay. Um... Oh, hey! My normal car! My original baby! You're back! Wait, where, where'd you go? Oh, there you are. Yeah! Oh! I haven't seen you in so long. Woo! I forgot about that. Normally I'd put up a kind of a, a metal block to prepare me for it, but I forgot this time. I was so excited to see my new car. My old car. I forgot the uh, preparation. I still don't know how I got in this view, camera view in the first place or how to get out of it. But whatever. All right. And he just had to pick a place to meet all the way across town. Chubby Buffalo? What kind of name is that for a restaurant? It's just, it's we. Oh, the handling in this is so much nicer. Yeah, see? I knew it. All I needed was something with a little bit tighter suspension and I wouldn't be crashing into everything. Oh, I'm so glad to have my original car back now. I love my, 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 uh... My new shiny muscle car. It's beautiful, it's got a lot of power, but oh my god. I, I pound that thing into the dirt every time I get behind the wheel. Because the suspension is so loosey-goosey that I... A 10 degree turn turns into a 90 degree turn. Like... In an instant, and it's it's devastating. And oh my god, why did I just lose control of my vehicle? You know what? I'm not gonna question it. It it doesn't need an, an answer. I am. Forgetting the fact that I live in a digital world now. My, my life is a video game. Quite literally, I'm not reading that. Nothing is supposed to make sense. Oh god! I think someone else is trying to get out and I just trapped them in there. I've never actually been to this restaurant. Don't suppose they've got some good barbecue. Hey, detective. Huh. 
Wonder what about? Detective Ward. Yeah, Ward. In the flesh. V, right? My partner, Detective Hun. Uh nice to meet you. Okay. Thanks for agreeing to meet. You really intend to work with a merc? Don't know what I intend just yet. For now, I'm gonna see if I hear anything new about Ryan's death. I've Go got some intel. That. Boss and a theory. To drop it. Don't make him say it again. You know he hates to say things twice. And if you couldn't give a rat's fat ass about any of that, heed my advice. As your friends, just let the case go. See me do anything? Just sitting here, sipping coffee, listening to gossip. Fine. Do what you want. I'm not about to be part of this. Gotta go get my little girl anyway. And you two at least find a quieter corner. Wouldn't want to be overheard. That's good advice, actually. Okay. He's got a point. Talk. Uh. Partner doesn't like. Detective Hans not a fan of edge runners. Don't take it personally. Detective Hans not Wait, a fan. Wait, when of did I become an edge runner? Except his daughter. You wanted to talk. For the attack, you wanted to talk to Ryan's hustle. Get some info to him. What was it? You know what? Han was right. Acoustics are a little too good in here. Got my car outside. I agree. Absolutely. Let's go. Okay. Sure. This is probably not a discussion we want to have that um, can be overheard. By the right sort or the wrong sort. Oh, is that your truck? Oh. Are you the one I blocked it? Well, whatever the car was that was right here, they apparently um, only managed to get out. Is my car going to spontaneously disappear again? Yep, it's gone. Some of the boys from the precinct saw Horvath around Arroyo shooting up dumpsters. Oh. There you are. How he's got to meet Bye. With the Brought him in. Bye, my pretty in? car. Peter Horvath. Cyber psycho who attacked the mayor later. They took him downtown, but then he got lost before they could get his statement. Yeah, I don't think he was a cyber psycho. So you saw him as a potential threat, decided to warn the mayor. Just like that? Because you got a good heart? Make it sound like that's something to be ashamed of. Ashamed? No. It's not something you see every day. It's not a characteristic that is very common among police. Said he got lost. How's that happen? What's it mean? It means someone didn't want him counting roaches in a cell that day. And before you ask me, no. I got no idea who. My turn. Why is Perales looking at this now? Why does he want it done unofficial on the hush-hush? Uh... I think he's gonna try and smear Holt with it, honestly, but I think he's got a case. As I see it, Perales is up to smear Holt. So he thinks Holt's involved? Then I no. do too, honestly. If he's not, a murdered mayor isn't great optics for his deputy. Perales could just be scared. Doesn't want the job of a guy who just got carried out feet first? <laughs> who would? D I'm, I think it's more along the lines of he doesn't want to immediately follow his his predecessor to the same grave, early grave. Red Queen's race. Heard anything about it? Know what it is? Maybe I have. Maybe I do. It got anything to do with Ryan? Guy was headed there the day he died. <sighs> Fine. We're gonna see my CI. You're what? I've heard it's some fancy ass club. No idea where to even look for it. See, I might know. Then we'll go talk to the woman Horvath worked for. Oh, or Chief actually, Inspector. We could see her first. Up to you. Uh, we? Sorry, we? Can't shake this case. Something's up. Just look how quickly it was closed. This way, you can get your job done while I find evidence that gets my chief to reopen the case. Win win. So, where to first? All right, partner. Let's go ahead and go meet with your CI, like you suggested. Let's see your informer. Club's a better lead. Fine with me.
Right. Whoa! Dude! And I thought I drove like a maniac. Do you even know what lines on the road are or mean? Are you... Wait, you've only got one eye. I take it back. You have an excuse. I don't. I just suck at driving. You are literally missing one eye and probably can't see where it very well out the other. But and yet somehow you're able to dodge most traffic. I was going to say just dodge traffic, but then you hit somebody. There's another one. And yet dude What? Hello, pedestrians! You're a cop! What are you doing? Holy... Never mind! You're a worse driver than me! At least I don't run into a pedestrian and then back up and then hit them again! Six times! You know what? Wake me up when this is over! Oh my god. My guy works here. You go talk to him. I'll wait outside. Tell him Igor says hi. He'll know what it's about. Sure. Can I get a sick bag plurt first? I think I'm gonna hurl because you're Let's driving. Go. Let's go. <sighs> Tell me about your guy. Who is this guy? A proud proprietor. He's got all sorts of clients, and he's nosy as hell. So he knows all about everyone. Plus, he's a coward. Perfect combo. So not Chief Inspector, like I thought. So why me? He doesn't know me. He knows you. He's your CI. Doesn't know me. Well, uh... Last we met, it didn't go Chief so well informant? for him. People he ratted out got wind of it. I think you got a better chance of getting him to talk without me. At least voluntarily. All right. Wait here, then. <sighs> Give me a second. Dino? What? What are you sending me? Gig? I'm not doing a gig right now, Dino. Upload a virus to Empathy Subnet. I'm not doing this right now. I don't know why you're sending me a gig. I'm not anywhere near a gig. Okay. Let's go make nice. Oh. He okay, head down. Head down. Don't look at anything. Uh, who, who am I? Who am I talking to? You're looking for a uh, uh, general inspiration hello? or something specific. I, I'm... I can help with both. Do you have any nausea medication? Uh Igor says hi. Fuck no. Said I was done. I was out. Oh, why do they have to run? Leave me the fuck alone, all of you. River. Hope you've got him. Fuck. Hey, Neil. This off. Hold Relax. on, dude. Just got one question to ask you. We're just here to talk. To see here, sir. Come on, ghost. I said. Leave me alone. Got it. Can't make me do a damn thing. Not trying to make you do anything. Rest assured, nobody will find out you talk to us, and this will truly be the last time Detective Ward will visit you. 
Isn't that right, Detective? Right. I swear it on the spirits of my ancestors. All we want is the courts for Red Queen's race. All right, but this is the last time, for real. It's outside city limits, near the river, Benita Street area. You been there? Made some deliveries, goods, sometimes peeps. We got no idea why you want to go poking around there. Club's empty. They shut it all down. Shut it down? Before or after Mayor Rhine died? Uh, soon after, I guess. Thanks, Neil. Not a coincidence. <sighs> My shit luck! Well, well. That's what I call a breakthrough. Uh, Seems yeah. promising, but I'd still hit that market. Market? Orvoth's employer, one I mentioned before. I just wouldn't let that lead drop. All right, let's check it out. Okay, let's go see this market of yours. We're gonna take my car? Yeah. Sure, thanks. Just give me one second. I saw a thing I am not leaving behind. So, the hell did you do to that guy? Why is he so scared of you? Like, come on, give me the deets. I mean, it's all over. I'm not going to tell anybody. All right, fine. You keep your secrets. And I'm going to try and keep my lunch down. A good 90% of any detective's job is talking. But you know that already. Must say, you're kind of natural. I've had a lot of practice. And the other 10%? What's it consist of? Writing reports. Well, that sounds kind of boring. So who are we talking to this time? So who are we supposed to talk to? Cyber Psycho's boss, you said? Christine Markov, 42. File has her as Horvath's sole employer. Sole contact, too, actually. Come on, V. Oh, you're actually coming with me this time. No subterfuge. No Igor says hi. No witness scared out of his mind. Or informant. I guess he wasn't really a witness. No idea who we're looking for. Gonna have to ask around. I'll start from the left. You take the right. Sure. Ask around. Discreetly. About a person who. Christine Markov. Where will I find her? I don't know her. Find something? Oh, not get out. You, Christine Markov? Me? No. She's over there, stall with the tech. He's really Thanks. bad at this. Christine Markov. Know her? Has a stall here. Don't know any Christine. This isn't BD Heads Anonymous. Oh, come on. Looking for a person. Lost track of you somewhere, but I found Christine waiting for you. Dude! What do you mean you lost track of me? I was right behind you. All right, all right. Ooh, wait, 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 wait. Nope. You might have the wrong person. I'd better go check some, uh, so, some, some evidence. Can't be too thorough now, can we? No, indeed. You can never, in a police investigation, ever be too thorough. Around.